I'll tell you what, I know the question that come out of your mouth, so I'm going to answer before. Who do I think is great now? The Usos. Well, I was uh, gonna, I, yeah, that was a question down the line. We can talk about them right now. They're also using, you know, the 3D as one of their mm -hmm. patented moves here. And are you honored by that? Because I know some fans get turned off when, for instance, you see Kevin Owens using the Stone Cold Stunner. People who grew up with Stone Cold Steve Austin go, that's what are you doing? But yet the DDT from Jake the Snake Roberts and so on and so forth. How do you feel seeing that being used? Well, what the, the fans have to hope they do. And I hope they watch this interview to let them know that they didn't just do it. They came to me and asked me, I, I would say almost two years prior to them using it. Mm. And I remember them asking me and I said, man, I feel honored and privileged if you guys did that. Because, you know, we came back to WWE and we started with New Day. And then we went from New Day to the Usos. So it was like being in the ring with them and working with them and seeing the talent that they had. I was honored and privileged that they even came to me and asked, you know, and I was like, absolutely. And I remember giving them pointers on how to do it in terms of how to make sure you pick up your opponent the right way. And when a guy comes over to cut them like Bubba does, uh, how to do that. And again, we had talked about that, like I said, almost two years prior to them, them using it. I remember Cesaro and Sheamus did it at a live event. <laughs> and they asked me then, would they be able to use it? And I said, absolutely. I think they did it once on TV. And each time they asked me, was it okay? I said, boy, I was like, listen, I'm honored and privileged that you came to me and asked me. I was like, and if Bubba says anything, I'll let Bubba know you did. <laughs> be like, I'm put their asses to a table. You yeah. know, my but, you know, we weren't wrestling anymore. You know, I was done. Bubba was still active, but nobody really does 3D without the other. So I was. it was an honor and privilege for them to do it. So absolutely, I was very happy when I saw it. And it was funny because I was home recuperating from back surgery. And I remember the Usos doing it one time, but it wasn't on TV. It was at a live event. And it didn't look you know, that good. And then I remember pulling him aside and talking to him about it. And I said, hey, listen, this is what went wrong. This is how you got to do it. And they were like, okay. And I thought they were like making the old man feel good. Okay, you know, yeah, whatever. But they they put it in their back pocket. I'm home watching one of the, one of the pay-per-views. And out of nowhere, I'm getting text messages and my Twitter notifications is blowing up. And I'm like, what the hell is going on? So I looked. I was like, oh, shit. What did Bubba do now? Oh, no. Because <laughs> it tagged me in it. I was like, oh, man. And it wasn't that he did it. It was just that the Usos had hit 3D. And I think they were calling it uh, the one. Yeah, the one, 1D. 1D. And I thought that was great. You know, even though I was like, we could have called it 3D. You give me full homage of it. But now, <laughs> I thought it was great. And when I saw them do it, I popped huge. I mean, remind you, I just had back surgery and I jump up out of my bed going, oh my God, I left. And I was like, wait, my wife goes, I thought, wait a minute, I thought you were hurt. I was like, oh my oh, back. Oh, yeah. honey, I can't lift those heavy boxes today. <laughs> but no, I was honored and privileged. I love them very much. Um, you know, the whole Usos and New Day rivalry, um, I helped produce those matches. I was very proud of that. Um, and the Usos and both New Day, you know, give me, you know, a lot, some credit. But I tell them all the time, you guys were in that ring doing it. I was just relating a message from Vince, you know, and what he wanted to be, be done in your match. And that was it. I think mean, you guys should take the full credit. But I love the fact that they were very humble enough to, you know, thank me and always put me um, in that category as being one of the uh, ones responsible for helping them um, you know, get that rivalry started. It was such a pleasure to watch those guys grow.